Well, I met Professor Dart in Lusaka at Phyllis Holden's 21st birthday party and he and the Gatti expedition, Attilio and Nino, Nino of whom I was very fond, uh, turned up, the three of them, at five o'clock when we were still drinking tea in the garden in northern Rhodesia. And um, I met them there. I met Professor Dart and somebody said, Kay is from Broken Hill. And he came to attention, he said, Broken Hill? He said, near the spot where Homo rhodesiensis was found. I said, on the spot. And from that moment we were great friends. Okay, that was Saturday. We had a lovely birthday party. About 80 people came from up and down the, t the uh, railway line and in from the bush to Phyllis Holden's 21st birthday party. And um, that was Saturday. I had told Dart I was from Broken Hill and so he changed the whole uh, schedule, schedule of uh, the uh, expedition of Gatti's careful planning and he and Gatti came, drove up to Broken Hill and arrived in the afternoon to surprise my poor father saying we met Kay at the party on Saturday night she told us she was from Broken Hill that we could come and see the spot of Homo rhodesiensis and here we are, may we see it. So they had a great look, two or three hours on the mine where this skull had been found in 19, I think, 21. It was found and believed to be about 50,000 years old. Since then, it has been aged at the Museum of Natural History in London and it is uh, nearly a million years old. So that was one time when the scientists underaged their find. It was very interesting. Our hats were off to them even though they were so wrong and on the, you know, the, the right side of being wrong. <laughs>